Good morning. I, we started talking with Vladimir about vulnerabilities that we have discovered since yesterday, and we've submitted reports about them, and we've discovered that most of the vulnerabilities were in the managing company. Also, I remember that in transportation company and banking system, we found, well, attackers have found a lot of vulnerabilities. Do you know something about that? Well, everywhere where web services are located, well, injections, RCE, remote program execution, remote code execution, and bypass, remote file execution as well. And how this approach is usual for daily life? Well, basically, these are real attacks. That's what usually happens, same like firewalls, and that's what firewalls is. Right now, it's in in the detect, but in real life it would block it. I have a nice slide for you, and right now it's going to be shown to our viewers. This slide is dedicated to investigation, investigation that was done by our researchers in the course of two days. Eight investigations have been accepted for from them, and uh, several of them from his cyber team, and in total there were 116 reports. Can you tell me about those incidents? What are those investigations? Why only eight of them? And why, why, why only five from one team? Yesterday, according to our advice, they gave us a lot of typical reports on attacks completed. In case city, we did have five unique admissible events. Leak of official information, personal data leak, demonstration of video materials in energy sector. They also uh, leaked some private information, confidential, and railroad tickets were uh, fraud, fraudulently replaced. Well, replacement of the tickets, they also have sent us a lot of reports about it by the evening tonight, last night, I mean. And investigated leak of official information. Okay, please look at how the techniques and tactics of attackers do align with accepted attacks. Uh, well, we do put them in the matrix, and what is the result? Well, all the actions are very similar. Also, blue team uh, send reports on atomic uh, events, but they are not assembled into the inadmissible events. They see how the criminals are moving, the red team, I mean. But while the red team will get to the target, to inadmissible events, the full report will not be accepted, and report is not accepted from the defenders until the invisible event is completed. I see the number has changed in the interface dedicated to analyze network traffic to 14 million from 11, which means that you, inside of your infrastructure, you have active people. I do have information. I was betting for oil industry and today they finally went to SCADA user segment. In tube company, first one, and several other teams, they already went to a the user segment, which means they have a chance. Yes, they should uh, raise the privileges, find an account, or send a command to controller, or get into the managing interface of SCADA and disconnect it. Do you know which teams? I know there's one Chinese team. Okay, do the work, you're doing a great job. And several other ones. Okay, just before we went to a live cast, you've been telling me about some uh, friendly people who yesterday communicated with our attackers and helped them. And it was not me and you. It was not me and you. Who was it? What happened? Well, all the participants have the possibility to find machine with the ITOP. What is this? ITOP is a software, a piece of software to, assemble, to collect information. You can find a version, you can scan ITOP, you can find an exploit, you can find a shell, drop this shell, and then collect information from other machines, and then drop inside. So all the teams, all the influences are possible through the admin segment, and this is done through the main controller. So here's a tip. 
Here's the tip. You need to go to the admin segment, raise the privileges and get it. So, this good guy is a digital entity that lives inside of the infrastructure and gives the admin rights or what? Well, gives tips. Gives tips. Okay. Is it easy to find him in chat? Somewhere in the forums. Uh, many people were able to communicate with him. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't know. You were not able. Okay, clear. What else was interesting out there? Well, generally speaking, everything is very stable. And I hope that today, before the end of the exercise, how many hours is left before the end? I understand today we are working until 4 p.m. So we have less than six hours to complete this. Less than six hours for the active work. And we know that in oil, in oil industry, there will be some interesting situations and you're very close. So don't be, 